Hi y'all, it's Nick here, and we're actually in June already, June 3rd, 2020. Um, I'm here with you today to show you about um, a hack for the clear plastic because I have quite a few huge ones of pour glue and they obviously come with the clear plastic. Um, I know of the parchment paper been there, done that, made a video about it actually. Um, but I wanted something different, something um, to where I don't have to take it off and replace it with something like the, uh, actually the release papers too that you can get from Ally and I'm sure eBay and all that. Um, so I was uh, searching YouTube like a lot of us do and I came across a YouTuber. Her name is Miss Crochet and Coffee. And she had this uh, video out. I thought it was awesome. Wanted to try it out. And I actually had a smaller pour glue one from uh, Pretty Neat Creative. And I figured, you know what, I'd give it a try. So basically all you do is you could take um, washi tape. Um, I will be using masking tape for my bigger ones because they're uh, 60 by 90, I believe. So that would be a lot of washi tape. So anyway, you take your um, tape and you section off in the sections and how many you want in your picture. You go down and then back up to where you have your squares that you can work at um, one at a time. Now, either um, you can use an X-Acto knife like I did for this square and you would just basically cut it down next to the tape which the tape will guide you to keep it straight I'm not gonna cut it because actually I need a new um, blade this one's pretty dull but I already cut it in advance and then you just pull it up and you can put a cover mind minder on it or actually it just sits by itself um, I will flip it upside down so you can see it's indented but I did not cut the canvas actually that's just where the tape is from um, me folding it so there is no cut there um, if you use it all the time you know how much pressure you can use if you're not comfortable with the knife that's fine too you can also take your scissors and you can lift it up and I already pre-cut this too as well. But you would take it along the tape as well. Just like you would with the knife. Pull it up. Ta-da. And then when you're done with it. Or um, you can leave them all together. If not, I always just cut off this top when I'm done with it. Um, if I don't finish the square that night, I can always just fold it back down. Keep it nice and neat and clean. Um, like I said, not my idea, but I wanted to put that out there so everybody has a little bit more options. Um, hopefully this helps. Uh, shout out to Miss Crochet and Coffee again. Uh, she is great. Check out her videos. Um, in the meantime, if you can like, subscribe, and share, uh, we will see you next time. Stay safe, healthy, um... And hopefully all this chaos in the world will settle down soon. Um, till then, take care of yourself and each other. Be kind. Do kind things. Um, and hopefully a little bit will go a long ways. Have a great day, y'all. Bye.